Beth McComb, my husband. I'm Tom. <laughs> and my daughter. Taylor. <laughs> and um, I'm so nervous. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be nervous. Uh, about me, so um, uh, a little more than half a year, and um, we're getting involved in ministry. Beth is teaching life group for three and four year olds. And I got involved in the the Nike uh, the Nike um, life. the Nike life group. Yeah, and Taylor. And I'm involved in the student ministry. I teach the sixth grade uh, middle school girls class on Sunday mornings, and have been a great time doing that. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Mm -hmm. We actually are transplants from Largo, Florida. We moved here because of Tom's job at Amazon, and we spent the first six months kind of looking around at churches to find what was the best fit for us, for our family. And um, during that time, we were also trying to buy a house in Nashville, which is um, difficult at the moment. So as we're looking at different houses over in this area, we really liked it. We're like, what's that church? Like, we should try that one. And we ended we up buying a house. driving by yeah. again and again, we're like, keep seeing this church. <laughs> so we ended up buying a house about a mile from here and as soon as we knew that's where we were gonna buy we started coming here just to like let's check it out for when we get over there and um, we fell in love the first time we were here. Everyone was so welcoming and we went to a newcomers lunch and Taylor met Anna of the middle school ministries and that they basically had us that hello. Mm -hmm. um, everyone is so welcoming and warm and we felt like people came, went out of their way to just meet us and know who we were and made us feel so welcome and we have never looked back. We were really, uh, really pleased to have some really good preaching when we got here. Uh, and that was probably enough to get us in the door but what has really kept us going is the relationships that we have in our life groups, uh, getting to meet new friends, and just uh, sharing sharing an experience with Christ with, with other people who are like-minded. It's been really exciting, uh, I think especially about my life group where uh, we've got a, a text group where we share uh, prayer requests and encouraging words for each other. And it has really made a big, a big difference for us just getting to know people here. Yeah, so uh, we went to that newcomer's lunch and I heard they were having a Star Wars night, which totally caught my attention. <laughs> um, and I offered to volunteer with them and I, I've been going every Sunday now in um, most Wednesdays and had the opportunity to go to Fuge Camp over the summer with the kids. Um, and this last week we just came back from Passion in Georgia and just the, the relationships that I'm building with the students up there is, it's definitely, this is, this is where God needs us right now. I think, I think God, um, we've, we've always been a family of service and wanting to, to, to give to others. And this church has really given us an opportunity to jump in, uh, get our, get our hands dirty, so to speak, get our feet wet in, in serving other people. Uh, uh, just getting involved in other people's lives has been really important to us. And I really feel like that is, that's one way that God has opened up a door for us to feel not just connected, but fulfilled in our ministry, where I really feel like God is using each one of us and the gifts that we have to make a difference. I also, through um, a friend in Tom's life group, we heard about a TV show called The Chosen and they really recommended it and we started to watch it. And um, I just feel Christ coming closer to me in my life as I watch his life on TV and we read the word here on Sunday and he has just really um, reinserted himself so strongly in my life and I'm really grateful for that. Yeah. Yeah. I think from, from the first moment first moment we came and just how personal everyone has been t for us, this really has felt like coming home. Um, this is a community of believers that truly cares about you and they want to get you involved. They want to be involved in your life. And um, it, everyone is just so personal and kind. And I, w I just want to say sometimes a big building can seem very daunting and, and it's very uh, intimidating to go in and just take a chance on a Sunday morning to just try a place out. And uh, especially for us, uh, our experience, again, like I said, we, we had tried several churches and, and, and nothing seemed to fit quite right. 
and then we tried this and it and it was worth trying it was worth taking that risk to go forward and and uh, and God has really used that for us to encourage us but then also again like I said to use us. Perfect. Um, I think I'm impressed um, with this church is it is a big church but with a small church feel like we feel connected here in a way that sometimes in the past we maybe did not feel like just like three faces in the pew and then gone until another week comes and we don't feel anything like that here. We feel already like part of the family and that's really important to us. Um, so with the student ministry we are going through a discipleship group and we are um, over the course of this year going to be reading through the entire Bible and just reaffirming my, my knowledge. Um, we grew up I, I've been raised Christian my whole life, um, but just reading these stories and discovering again for myself um, God's promises to us and his commitment to um, enriching our lives uh, has just been incredible to discover again. And the fun thing for us is that we read through all of her homework with her <laughs> and discuss as a family. So that's uh, another neat time in our week when we gather together to read through many passages of the Bible and talk through them again. And it's becoming alive again. Yeah. Awesome. Oh, cool.